There it is, guys. The six liter is still with us. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today's gonna be another one of those members videos that, again, the first several are not, are gonna be just open. But again, some of the behind the scenes stuff, some, my God, I look awful. Anyway, uh, so I just got up a little bit ago. It's Saturday. It's been an incredibly long week, but we have to get parts back to Ford, go pick up our brake hose for the passenger side that needs replaced here. These brake calipers are literally from the video like a year ago. I haven't returned them because I suck. So anyway, just some random running around this morning. Maybe if I have time, we'll quick run over. I'll show you guys the white truck. I know you guys probably want to see the white truck. Maybe we'll stop over, do a little visit, let you guys know it's still, it's still here. It really is. So I'm going to get this stuff loaded up. I'll see you guys in the truck. Okay, you can't really see it. This is my local dealership I go to, Honda Ford. Um, these guys have been super cool to me, love their parts department. Uh, I've only used their service department once or twice on the 6 liter, but anytime I did they were super cool, um, no complaints there. So we just finally dropped off the brake calipers I bought a year ago uh, when I did the brake job. I finally returned the cores. We have a brake hose uh, on order for my passenger side front wheel because that caliper is sticking and uh, the caliper is new so i think it's probably the hose giving the issue after that we'll uh diagnose it further if that doesn't resolve it but they do have i gotta show you they do have this really ugh, hitting my camera they do have a super cool tremor got to go around back of the building to get to the tremor otherwise i'd be standing in the road just coming around You guys don't know it, but Josh and I each had one of these F-150s. He had a blue one, and I had a black one. He had the extended cab, I had a crew cab. Cool trucks. Oh, look at the 450. I'd love a 450. I want this Tremor even more, though. There it is. That Tremor is gorgeous. And darn it if I don't want one. Yeah, I think, uh, I think the next truck needs to be a Tremor package. Now, I think I'm going to take you guys over to DNA and show you the uh, white truck and that it still is a thing. So I'm going to see you guys over at Diesel and Automotive. I'll see you in a little bit. There it is, guys. The 6 liter is still with us. You know, I know I haven't driven in a while. This still irritates me that that happened to my decal. But there it is. Just to prove it, the crappy bed liner that I still didn't take out. We got the six Obros. It's not an engine, it's a movement decal. The six inch exhaust tip. I do love the look of this truck. Look at these wheels, I love these wheels. I still need to get, get the cover for these and they obviously need cleaned up. The white door handles that actually broke, I need to replace these. These came out really good. My white tow mirror caps. I love those things. There it is, guys. The truck is still... The truck is still alive. It needs some love. Evidence of the broken nonsense that needs repair. I miss it, guys. And even more importantly, look, th this is upsetting. We got rust. We have the infamous rust that forms here. So guys, just to prove, now we are at Diesel and Automotive, so I don't have the truck in my actual possession, but the truck is still obviously here I'm thinking we have a lifter issue. So I've thought a lot about this, especially as you guys very clearly, and I love that you guys want this truck back so much. I miss this truck too. I can't wait to have this truck back. I miss driving around with my redneck American flag and my six Obros decal up there. I don't miss the bed. 
this definitely needs fixed when this truck comes back. But honestly, I do really, really miss this truck. It's just been sitting. It's very upsetting. But guys, when this truck comes back, we have lots of plans. We're gonna, trust me, this truck, when it's back on the channel full time, we have a lot of cool stuff planned. There's so much six liter content left to come. I forgot the badges. The badges are like one of my favorite parts. Although I will say, these badges I got clearly leave a little something to be desired in the longevity department, which is why when it comes back, we'll probably get all new badges again and we're gonna go get them all powder coated before we put them on. And we're gonna go with like a gloss black, uh, kind of go with the black and white theme I have. I think I'm even gonna change out there's nothing wrong with these taillights, but I think I'm gonna even change these out. I don't love the chrome housing. I love the overall look. Don't get me wrong, I love this look. We'll keep that. But I wanna go with the blacked out housing and smoked lenses. But this truck, I love this truck. And I know some of you guys are worried that this truck is gone forever and it's not. We're just getting some money ready for it. I love this truck so darn much, it's absurd. But yeah, so big, big plans for this truck, like just the perfect amount of tire poke. Do you guys see this? Just perfect, just comes out a little bit. Not too much, not too little. Gives a nice look. This truck probably gonna get lifted a little more, maybe another two inches, because we're not lifting this truck. We are gonna put bigger tires on. These tires are going away. I'm done with the, this wheel tire combo. We're going, I got platinum wheels you guys saw in one of the more recent videos. My exhaust. One thing I hate about this exhaust, I gotta mess with it more. But I feel like that's, guys, am I being picky? I feel like that's, I don't like this. I want it to be more sturdy. Maybe I'm being ridiculous, I don't know. We're gonna figure that out later. Anyway guys, I wanted to show you the truck you guys have been asking for it non-stop. So it's cold out, it's very cold out. So I figure this is like the perfect time to take a cruise over here, it's a slow day. Um, the weather's not great, so I don't know that I'm gonna do a lot on the truck. We'll probably review Bless Performance race tune today or their performance tune, excuse me. I don't think they call it a race tune. Stay tuned for that video for the proper name for that uh, tune. But yeah, I wanted you guys to see we have the truck it hasn't gone anywhere and that we're not done with what we're doing with six liters there's a lot of cool stuff left to do in that department and i'm going to do it guys i'm going to be honest there's a lot of money when this is back that's going to go into this we're going to gut the interior redo it all new carpet we're going to get the seats all taken care of the sunroof needs fixed we're going to this truck has at least another life left in it not to mention the transmit do you guys want to see the transmission i'm going to show you the transmission Oh, it's hard to see. It's powder coated and nice though. Okay, I lied. There's not enough light to get to it, but it is cool looking, very cool looking. I think to this day, it's one of my most liked pictures on Instagram is the picture of the transmission casing after it got done powder coat. Anyway, everyone, I wanted to show you the truck, let you know it is still here. I do, I've thought about this a lot and I do really believe one of the lifter guides is what the issue is. And I think the lifter guide itself failed. Taking out a lifter and my darn cam, it's gonna be super upsetting if I'm correct on this. I would much rather it be something on the top end of this engine because that's much easier to repair and fix. Uh, it's also much cheaper. I do miss my 12 and a half wide tires. Anyway, um, so that's what I'm thinking, which is super upsetting, but we'll figure it out. We'll get this truck back on the road, guys. A lot more to come. Anyway, if you haven't already, don't forget merch. New merch stuff on the store now. It's live. We have delete, tune, stud, repeat. We have SOB on the front with making six liters great on the back. That all just went live. So go check that stuff out. For a limited time, code six liter. I'll put it on the screen this area or down in the description six liter will get you a discount on all the merch go check that stuff on teespring 
Hopefully the wind hasn't ruined this vlog, guys. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up. Guys, what are you most excited about the six liter coming back to the channel? Drop that down in the comment section. Can't wait to hear it, guys. I'll see you in the next upload.